What do you do when price is making higher highs and higher ho lows and we're continuously making all time has at this point. So if we look at gold, gold has made the highest of the highs at this point. This is the first time you're ever seeing gold reach 2520. So let me explain something here to you. Right now, gold is an instrument that's going to go towards your nearest whole numbers. Like the first whole number was obviously 2500. Next, we had 2505. Next, we had 2510, 2515, 2520, 2525. And at, if we look at this right over here, we have almost tapped into 2525. Now, the thing is, you cannot take a sell over here because we know about gold. If gold starts to continue, it's going to continue to rocket without any confirmation for sell. So the best thing that I would want to do in this case is to, I would want to wait for price to break below 25.15. This is a very strong hold number because look at this candle. We rejected this area, but the next candle respected this low and did not break. So if you're only looking for sells and you're not comfortable with these buys that are happening, you got to wait for price to break below 25.15 because if we break below 25.15, this is a 90 pip range you're looking at at this point. So what I'm doing is my favorite way to combat this is just to wait. I'm waiting to see whether we will start to consolidate over here or are we going to start to break below 25.10? Are we going to start to break below 25.10? That's it. But at this point, this is history in the making where the, for the first time in mankind, gold is at 25, 25. Crazy.